Hello guys, this is Mantha and this is the fourth part of the tutorial of how to create a word processor in Visual Basic and VB.net, okay? In this tutorial, I will finish up the toolbar items, okay? Okay, let's continue. Let's add another button. And write it open file. And just copy it and paste it on the tooltip text by Ctrl C and Ctrl V. Now change the image to something better than that okay let's find some cool images okay double click the open file the png okay this looks good and click ok wait for a while Now go up and name it button open file. <clears throat> okay, create another button and name it button save file and change the text to save file. and tooltip text to save file and change the image to mm, save as oh sorry not that let me switch it to thumbnails mm. This one, or okay, that one, okay. This one looks good, and click OK. Okay, now another button and change the text to. Mm, change the text to save save file okay okay on the older one change this to save as okay wait 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 Now this one to button save file. Oops, sorry. Don't give any space. Display name to save file. And image to Save HS and tooltips text to save file. 
Okay, I have missed it. I have forgot to put save file on the other things, the display name, okay? So let me put it now. Now write save as display name and open file. Okay. So thank you guys for watching this tutorial. I'll see you in the next one.